Well, the answer is we will see, but I think it's interesting to, to listen. What, what is your sense? Ben Freeman. Question for either Charles or Peter or both. Well, uh, I'm the chair. <laughs> Neither of, n neither of you mentioned uh, illegal activity. Mm. <laughs> and I'm curious uh, whether you think there's a serious danger that new forms of electronic transfer, cryptocurrencies and other items, uh, could be used in a way that would greatly <coughs> proliferate the extent of uh, illegal activity. And I have in mind, of course, things like tax evasion and uh, money laundering, but I also have in mind much more uh, pernicious activities, the most obvious of which I think is malware attacks. Uh, we had one, uh, quite a public one in the uh, United States, in which a hospital was attacked and uh, it turned out that the, there's a ransom of some millions of dollars that was paid. Uh, the question is, how did the people get away with that? Well, the answer is obvious. They took payment in Bitcoin, and that was that. So uh, once it becomes widely understood that uh, people can do things like this, do you see a danger that uh, the integrity of the tax system uh, could um, be eroded, that uh, regulations against all sorts of things, gambling, prostitution, drug running, could become much greater once that becomes easier to hide the profits. And even uh, these more outstanding things, um, and malware is one example, but I think there are others. The answer is yes. Okay. I mean, clearly, yes. I mean, that was part of the purpose of, of Bitcoin, to make sure that no government, police force, tax inspector, whatever, could get their hands on you. I mean, that's the whole purpose of the exercise. But there is a wider issue, which I thought you were also referring to, which is if we try and do everything electronically, everything, it raises our fragility in the face of cyber attack. And I, I having both uh, electronic payment mechanisms and currency, I think, is a protection against uh, cyber attack having a devastating effect on our economies. And if that's true, then do you think central banks have a role in uh, preventing the what you're seeing? Yes. yes, it's part of the integrity of the payment system, which is yes. one of the responsibilities. Yeah. yeah the answer is yes. Uh, other qu comments, questions, quickly. If not, I mean, we get a chance at, at the end. But uh, Lars, maybe we. What is your topic now?